With some breaking news, folks, this is out of Buckhead, where Atlanta police say an officer shot and killed a man who allegedly shot a security guard at the Fogo de Chao restaurant. Let's get right out to our Paula Soro live on Piedmont Road, where it all went down just a few hours ago. Paula? And Jennifer, you know, we actually just saw an ambulance pull out of the restaurant about 30 minutes ago and a couple minutes after that, the road here, Piedmont Road behind me reopened, but the scene looked quite different just a few hours ago. I'll step out of the way so that you can see what the scene looks like right now. You can still see some Atlanta police cars out here, the GBI on scene as well. APD tells us a discussion began at the bar area of Fogo the Chao here on Piedmont Road, then moved towards the front entrance where an officer shot and killed a man. His friends tell us to Tonight, that man was a former employee here. Atlanta police say they responded to a call of an unruly person at Fogo de Chao in Buckhead Wednesday night. When they arrived, a security guard tried escorting the man who was sitting in the bar area outside of the restaurant and deployed his taser, uh, which had negative effect on this subject. Police say the man stood up to try to leave the restaurant and the security guard then tackled him. While tackling the subject, uh, the subject was able to uh, retrieve his weapon uh, the suspect's weapon and uh, fired one shot uh, into the security guard, at which time one of our officers did deploy his firearm, fatally injuring the uh, subject. But he's fun, bubbly, he loves to have fun, he jokes around. Lena Woodward, who says she's a close friend of the man killed and a former employee of the restaurant, says he used to work as a busboy at Fogo de Chao. Like, I just got multiple calls. Nigel, I did hear Nigel got into a conversation. I don't know with who, with whoever. I have no idea. And then the next call, like I said, two minutes later was he's gone. And what I did, I left from working out and I came here. Several witnesses hid under tables. At the time, Ronald McNeil was on the phone with his wife, who says she was sitting next to the bar and tried helping the security guard. She was just getting up off of the floor from trying to give towels to them as they were holding the, the, the security guard who also got shot. They were trying to put towels on his chest before he was able, before the EMT got to him. And tonight, the security officer is in the hospital, but in stable condition. And APD tells us that a weapon was recovered from the scene. And they also tell us that the GBI is now investigating. And as mentioned earlier, GBI is still here on the scene.